Time to play with some clay. right away for the uh, sound of the uh, heater but I had forgotten to come down and turn on the heater earlier today so it's taking a while for it to get up to temperature so that I'm not freezing in here once it turns off I'll go turn off the heater and then I won't be bothered with it anymore today uh, so anyway I'm going to be uh, working on this leg today I haven't been feeling too good today in fact I'm Got a stomach ache right now, and uh, so I don't know how long I'll work, but I'll work as long as I can because I want to get this done. I've got an idea for another piece, and I'd like to get started on that. It's called a fertile imagination. <laughs> My mind is always going. Yeah, about. Uh, Two o'clock this morning, I woke up uh, after going to bed about 11 with an idea for a, a sculpture that uh, I'm not going to say anything about right now, but I will fill you all in on it when I get started on it, if I get started on it. That's just the reason I'm not going to say anything, because I don't know what I'm going to do yet. So anyway, I'll just continue working on the uh, leg and uh, hopefully get this to the point where I can start on something else. I'm thinking of changing the loincloth because, let me show you, the loincloth on him is really long and it looks like just uh, some cloth of some kind. And uh, I'd like to do something like that. I think that would take care of a lot of problems back here in the back and uh, having it on the ground and stuff like that and I can just imagine him walking with that on it, how dramatic that would look anyway that's just my thinking right now so let's get started on this uh, night sentinel the night sentinel I had an artist friend of mine who is doing a sculpture and he, he came with an idea for a sculpture he's working on at about the same time called Camp Sentinel uh, or Village Sentinel. And uh, I think it was kind of funny that he and I both came up with ideas almost similar. That's kind of neat. Okay, I just have to do some texturing inside the uh, area. Well, before I can put the uh, clay back down on the level top of the uh, cutting board, I mean this uh, sculpting stick.
Well, it don't take much. <laughs> Knock everything over. <sighs> yeah, I like the look of that. I'm going to rearrange this just a little bit more. Alright, I'm going to uh, call it quits right now and uh, turn off my lights here. I'll show you why I can't work during the daytime. I got this huge window right here. Those blinds block the view outside and view inside, but it doesn't block the sunlight. And that sunlight is boiling into the window because of uh, they, they're facing south. Uh, in the summertime, the sun's higher, so it doesn't, it's not as bad. And I can come down here earlier in the daytime. But at night, or in the afternoon, or in the wintertime, it's right there, the sun. It's down south. And so it comes, that's why the north windows are much better for a studio than the south windows. I've got to put some curtains up. And I gotta figure out where I'm gonna get some that'll fit this window, and and, and something that I can pull aside uh, when it's not uh, uh, in use. But I have to come down here so late in the afternoon because of the sun that uh, it just it, I got no time to work. It's hard to go upstairs when you're 74. <laughs> I've been doing it for, well, let's see, four months now. Let's see, July, July, August, September, October, and now we're in the middle of July, uh, November, so almost five months. Anyway, I've got to do my video now, and this is one of the reasons why I can't work after a certain time, because if I do, I, I'll be working on my video, editing it, and getting it loaded onto YouTube. I'll be doing it about uh, 1 or 2 in the morning, so it still gets out late. Anyway, I bring my uh, camera gear up. I loaded onto my computer all these uh, videos I shot. All right, everybody, I'll be back on that piece tomorrow. I'm going to be uh, working on his uh, loincloth tomorrow. Okay. Let's see if it shows up. I'm yakking now. i got to get busy. Everybody have a great night, and I'll see you tomorrow. Give me a thumbs up and share my video. And then check out my instructional DVDs, uh, the link down below this video. All right, see you next time.